Hey guys, Trey here. Let's talk about the Monport laser a little bit more. You just got your laser and you want it fired up. I understand. So we turn everything on and our first thing we do, we're gonna hit pulse. Oh no, we have an error code. What could the error code be? First of all, our door is open. We've got to close the door for safety reasons. So let's close our door. Perfect. All right, let's clear the code. All right, door's closed. Let's hit pulse again. Oh no, what's our error code this time? Water error. That's the most common issue that I've seen lately. A lot of people forget to turn on their water cooler. Let's see how it's done. Our issues that we have may have with that and let's fix it. So first of all, let's hope that maybe you just forgot to turn on your cooler. That happens, we all do it. That's why the machine's smart enough to tell us that there's no water flowing. Let's check it out. All right guys, so for the sake of the video, let's say we have it on. Our water cooler is on and flowing correctly. It's kind of loud, so I'm not gonna turn it on for the video. But our sensor and our error code are still saying no water detected. A couple of things could be going on. First, you may have the lines hooked up incorrectly if this is your first time. That way, the sensor isn't catching the correct flow and won't detect it and tell the machine to, to fire properly. The sensor is way back in here. It's kind of hard to see. I've got a little chair or a little desk here, so it's hard to open this door, but it's right there. A couple things could happen. The sensor could just be bad. Anything can happen. You can test it. I'm not going to go into detail about that right now, but if you do have questions on that, message me if you've done everything else. All right guys, our water cooler is on. We are pumping fluids and you can see we have no error codes up and we're gonna go ahead and pit pulse and everything functioned perfectly like it should. All right, so let's backtrack of what we've done. First, we go to fire our laser and we have a door error. Easy enough, we close the door, the sensor's picking it up. Second of all, we have a water error. So we first check to make sure our pump is on. If the pump is on, great. If it isn't, turn it on. Oops. If so, if the pump is on and we still have a water error, the water could be flowing backwards. Double check it. It happens to the best of us. If that's still going on, check your sensor to see if it's actually functioning properly. If not, you have ways of testing that as well, but hopefully you don't need to, especially if it's a new machine. If so, contact us and we'll see what we can do for you.